Good afternoon, folks. Admiral Preparedness here. We're still alive and well. well I will say alive. And, of course, uh, the research never stops. This young fellow right here is doing a review of several different uh, solar cells. And these are excellently reusable for homes or portable uses, such as his RV. Of course, the prices can vary, so you want to be due diligent with your homework before you go out and purchase these things. Understand that it's not just a solar panel, but the charge controller, cables, mounting and mounting hardware, and all the other items that come with it, batteries, cables, racks, and whatnot. But folks, always being prepared means just that. Electricity could go away by a storm or other items, causes, and things like that. So you want to make sure that you do your homework with solar. I have several different versions that I have. So not just one type, but there are many types. A few days later... And, of course, when you're thinking about solar, you have to think about security, placement, shading, and maintainability, and uh, not having them grow feet and disappear. Uh, there are different versions out there. I like the polycrystalline, but there are better ones out there now. The efficiency is about 23% for the more expensive ones but you don't really need to buy expensive that's where the key is here folks there are budget panels out there right now that can last several years if not decades just being left alone as long as nobody tampers with them they're kept clean and uh, maintenance is done regularly on them which is pretty much just keeping them clean checking the connectors and making sure that the atmosphere conditions haven't affected them but there are other things to think about I'll leave a link with this gentleman's website here so you can see. It's a very good channel. Yeah, but preparedness here. We're occupying our time by doing our homework. Solar, solar, solar. The sun will always be there.